Stop daydreaming, recruit. You listening, boy? Blocking incoming attacks is the most important thing you'll learn today. Prove to me you were paying attention. Good. Now, show me you can block a real attack. Get ready. Good. Notice your stamina bar drains after a successful block. If you run out of stamina, you won't be able to block or attack. Now, move your feet, recruit. To always effectively block, make sure you are looking right at the tip of your enemy's weapon. Keep it in the center of your view as you block. Now, block my attack three times. Good. Block two more. Block one more attack. Good. Now, show me your destructive power. Shatter those pots. Notice your stamina drain if you miss too often. Great job. Now, try to hit me. Watch your timing. Hit me when I'm open. Strike right before or after my sweep. Good. Give me one. Excellent. Now stand down, criminy. Take a look at those logs. You have three basic attacks. Slash, overhead, stab. Show me slash. Overhead does more damage. Stab has the most reach. Good work. Those logs put up quite a fight. Now, hit me again with one of each attack. Slash. Nice stab. Excellent. Now stand down, you're nuts. Oh, ugly crockery in my arena. Kick it over. Apologies, ah. my lord. Kick can also be used to break someone's block. Try it on me. Ah. Block with kick. Ah. Nice guard break. Ah. One more time. Ah. Ah. Great. One ah. more time. Ah. Excellent. There are other ways to get around a shield. See if you can get in here with a sneaky stab. Get around my side. Excellent. Well, those are the basics, recruit. You'll need more training before you really find glory on the battlefield. But you'll do fine as a meat shield for the bigger boys. Report for duty, cadet. You there. General Malrick tells me you turned down his offer to join the order. I'll give you one last chance to change your mind, well. Right choice. Now prove you are born of Mason Metal. <laughs> well, look what stumbled into my arena. You ready to handle comboing, recruit? Watch. See how I swing my blade back and forth? You try. Good. Now, hit me with a combo. Twice more. Once more. Good. But not good enough. To be truly effective, you'll need to fake out your enemy. 
by missing with the first swing of your combo. Then follow up and make contact with the backswing. Hit me with a combo backswing. Now hit me with two more backswings. attack costs stamina so you'll need to decide when to combo very carefully one last trick because you'll need every shifty trick you can learn you can trick your enemy into blocking early by starting an attack then canceling it mid-swing like this if your enemy falls for this trick and blocks early he'll be left wide open for an attack start an attack then faint before it's complete. Try a faint now. Good. Notice fainting also drains stamina. Now, try to hit me after you trick me with a faint. Yeah. <laughs> Twice more. You slippery little cuss, once more. Now you can piss everyone off with your shady tricks. All right, we're done here. Report for duty, cadet. says we can do anything we want to the lower ranks. You think we're just gonna let you walk away from what you've done? Shut him up, Shifty! Makes each class different, eh? Pick one of the maesters over there, and he'll show you what he knows. Huh. Ah, another man of sheer power, eh? A good knight is an armored shield for their brothers in arms. A knight uses power and strength over speed, cutting the enemy down and pushing them back from the front. We can use two-handers with one hand, as long as a shield is in the other hand. Draw your sword of war. Switch from two hands to one. Try your sword and shield on Sir Drum. Hit him thrice and block him thrice. <laughs> You might oh, one more hit. Three blocks. Though a knight is not graceful or fast, they can strike with unmatched strength. 
And a knight behind a tower shield is just about unhittable. Equip your tower shield. Three hits and three blocks on Sir Drum! Nice. One more hit. Three blocks. Nice. One more hit. Well done. Few knights with tower shields can block up an entire city gate with a shield wall. You can use shield bash to push away annoying enemies. Try a shield bash now. Yeah. Good. Now shield bash Sir Drum three times. <laughs> two more. <laughs> One more. <laughs> Good. Be careful if man at arms doesn't break your guard with a <laughs> kick or a fire pot. How you feeling, Drum? <laughs> That's all there is to it, cadet. Come back anytime. So, you like to have the best of both worlds, eh? A good vanguard chooses his targets wisely, descending upon them with both great force and skill. Most of our weapons are two-handers. So, we can strike with great power, but cannot move as quickly as the lighter classes. Though, no one is as slow as Sir Knight here. Draw your long blade. Now, hit and block, Sir Drum, three times. Good block, two more. Incredible skill. After sprinting a short way, you can execute a sprint attack. Sprint at Sir Drum and attack when in range. How? Oh! Sprint at Sir Drum and attack when in range. That looks painful. Come back here. Only the Vanguard has access to pole arms. Show me yours. Pole arms have the most reach. You want to keep a good distance between you and your enemy. Why not try it out on Good Lord Drum? Good block. Two yeah. more. Nice. One yeah. hit. Yeah. One more hit. Yeah. Special weapon, the smoke pot. Use them to obscure the view of tiresome archers. In fact, throw yours at Archer Pete over there. I love the smell of salt. I love the smell of salt. I'm glad to have you in the Mason Order, Cadet. We'll shake this haggard battalion right up. You like your combat fast and smart, huh? Man-at-arms is the fastest class, but also one of the least armored. A good man-at-arm keeps moving. They are masters of knowing when to run, to effectively return in a flurry of blows. The broadsword is your best friend, but less effective against the heavily armored. Blunt weapons are more effective against heavily armored. To be truly effective as a man-at-arms with a blunt weapon, You'll need to land many hits quickly. Hit a drum three times in a row without getting hit yourself. Be yeah. fast. Yeah. One more. Yeah. Hey, calm down. Sometimes going berserk isn't viable. Learn to effectively dodge and you'll be unhittable. See how I duck back and forth? You try. Good. Now dodge. And hit Sir Drum three times. Nice. Two more. One more. Good job. Not a special weapon for the man at arms. The oil pot. 
Foil parts can be used to get around the shield. Throw one at Sir Finian. Training. Good luck. Halt! There's the rat who slew our comrades! Come on, Die! Die!